Hi, welcome to the orchards. My name is Martins, your agronomist from Avocare Consultants, and we want to talk about the green gold business. We want to talk about the avocado, has avocado fruit farming and industry. Today and this morning, I am in Iganga, where we are currently training the Busoga Cooperative Society. And we are happy, proud to be part of the journey by this giant cooperative union. Actually, this is probably the biggest cooperative union uh, dealing in avocado wow. in Uganda. Wow. With a massive number of members and a determined leadership that would want to see Busoga at the heart of avocado production. Today, in our program, as we always do it, we talk to farmers, we listen to what they say, we want to know what they do, and then it is from here that we take it upon us to come up with tailor-made solutions to every region's problems, because the problems vary according to, to every region. And uh, today, on my left here, is a farmer, Munulo, Munulo Ibrahim. Yes, mm. Munulo Ibrahim. Mm. My dear friend and farmer, yes, please introduce you, yourself. Tell us where you're coming from, the locality, and uh, tell us something about your business in Hass Farm. Thank you so much, Martin, from Avocare Consultants. You're welcome. You're most welcome to our region. Thank you. Most especially to rescue us from the challenges we are meeting in this mm -hmm. industry. Mm -hmm. Avocado, has avocado industry is very new, mm -hmm. as you, are, you have always known. Mm -hmm. We have known it for a very short time, but we have been encouraged by passion to grow it. Mm -hmm. And from the advisors and what you tell us about has avocado, we are yet to find out. However, I'm Wanira Ibrahim Munuro a resident of Iganga district. I'm a civil servant working with the Luuka district government as a senior human resource officer. But I have a passion of agriculture. Okay? Mm -hmm. Previously I was dealing in nuts, supplying them with some seedlings, mangoes and citrus seedlings for some good years. Okay? So when I heard of this, I got encouraged. And I have a farm as of now, I have 15 acres, which are not doing very well because of the challenges, as I've said, but we have come here to get solutions. Mm -hmm. I know I will benefit a lot from this, this workshop we are having here, especially from an expert of Hassava mm -hmm. I was told you are an expert in Hassava We are as Avocare. As Avocare. Yes. Someone told us Martin is yes. the, the brain behind it. Mm -hmm. So I'm privileged that I'm meeting Martin himself. Mm -hmm. Maybe from here I'll be going to the orchard so that you have a look at what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. I've been in this industry for one year now. I began uh, last year in around August. I bought around uh, 700 seedlings from Musubi Farm. Okay? Mm -hmm. And out of the 700, about 20 survived. 20 survived. Others dried up. Others were uprooted by the hostile community. This community is always hostile to, to new things and uh, they don't want change. They need to be educated about what has avocado is. So I have around what? Around 20. In uh, April, I got more seedlings. I was advised by Ibrahim to contact who? Contact Musubi again and they subsidized the price. Last time I had bought at 8,000 per seedling but this in April, I was paying 2550 okay? Yeah. And NADS mm. was meeting the rest. Yeah. I'm grateful to NADS mm. that came to RS2 and is asking so much mm. because you can't afford replacing at that price. Mm. I was almost giving up. Then I was encouraged by, by NADS that, no, come on, you, you come on board, you shall subsidize, and I paid at that much. However, the challenges are, are too many. To our partners, uh, the Ugandan government, the Minister of Agriculture, and NADS. 
Thank you very much. You've heard what the farmer is saying. You've come to their rescue. You've been able to subsidize and pay 70% for the farmers to be able to access this extremely somehow expensive seedlings. To our partners out there, NADS, thank you very much. To the leadership of NADS, thank you very much. To the parliament that has always allocated money uh, for NADS to make sure that this uh, program continues to run. We say thank you, thank you, thank you. And you've heard it from the farmer. So, uh, why has in particular? Just as you, in your introduction you said green gold. Yes. Isn't it? Yes. It's a green gold. It is. We are exploring what is in the green gold mm -hmm. and encouraging the community. Okay? Mm -hmm. We have gone so many things of late, mm -hmm. sponsored by, by nudged farmers. Mm -hmm. They have not done well in this region, Soga. Mm -hmm. And I believe has will do a lot. Mm -hmm. And from what the information we get from 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 the website in the outside world and from the, the consultants, there is has avocado as as a as a crop. Is it a crop? Yes. It what, is. Is, what is it? It is. It is. The result of future. Because we are told that two and a half years you start what? Floating. Yes. Among the 20 which I said earlier that remain, mm -hmm. one has a fruit. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. Less than what? Less mm -hmm. than one year. I had a fruit, one fruit. I don't know whether it is a cast or not, but <laughs> there is, it is there. Which, which, which means the rest will also be floating in the somewhat same period. Mm -hmm. And it has really encouraged us so much mm -hmm. that not even two years, mm -hmm. but less than two years, if you well managed, mm -hmm. you can get the fruits at least what, less than two, two years. Now, let us now focus more on the challenges that you've gone through in the last uh, one and a half years that you've been in this industry. Share with us uh, what your challenges are. The challenges are of two versions. One, those that are already known to me, and there are those that I don't know, but they affect what? The industry. Mm -hmm. That is we, a classic. We, yes, we, we, we the get, ones you know we, and the ones you don't. Know. We don't know. We get to know them after sharing with you. They say, "Oh, maybe that's all a challenge, but I didn't know." Mm -hmm. That's why we are here to know. Yeah. First and foremost, it is with the, sorry to say, but it's with the suppliers themselves. Mm -hmm. You get the seedlings, but they give you the seedlings only. They don't offer technical guidance to the farmers that do A, B, C, D, plant like this, plant like this, and how you have this, how we have to manage it. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. you take the seedling and you do it on your own. Mm -hmm. Whether it grows or not, I don't know. Whether it is a business to them, I don't know. Mm -hmm. From what I know, now it's has subsidized to us. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. so there is a lot that needs to be to be told from from the suppliers, so that they give an extra hand mm -hmm. of advisory. Okay, yes. then what do we apply? Mm -hmm. We are advised through the various means of communication that you have to use organic fertilizers, not chemical fertilizers, okay? Mm -hmm. So, us as farmers, we are lay men, or we are lay women, or we are lay people, okay? Mm -hmm. We don't know which fertilizers you mean. There are so many organic fertilizers on the market. Mm -hmm. We don't know which one is authentic and which one is not authentic, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. The Minister of Agriculture has kept quiet. It's not coming out. Mm -hmm. We are finding, we are exploring this information on our own selves. Mm -hmm. by our own selves, okay? Mm -hmm. We don't know where to go, who to advise us and when. Mm -hmm. The extension farmers we have at the sub-counties mm -hmm. are ignorant about it. Mm -hmm. So we don't know whether it is a government project or it is not. Mm -hmm. But government is subsidizing. Mm -hmm. Now who is to advise us? Mm -hmm. They are not aware of what to do and how we should do it. Okay? Mm -hmm. So it is a challenge. How do you plant? Mm -hmm. Do we plant down or on molds. Mm. On the platform we are advised to point or not on molds. Mm. Other farmers tell us plant down. Then they tell us when there is water water luggage, it dries. Mm. Okay? When there is too much water. But when again they tell us if you don't water within four days it will dry up. So mm. what do we do? Mm -hmm. The systems we use for irrigation are mm. rudimentary. 
I have 15 acres as I said, but I carried the water for irrigation on my head. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. Watering each and every what? Every mm -hmm. plant. It's mm -hmm. very tiresome. Okay, it is my business, but mm -hmm. I need to inspire others. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. Now, will they get inspired when I'm carrying water on my head, watering every, every other plant after mm -hmm. every four days? Mm -hmm. They will not. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. But from the advice we get from the other consultants, they say, this is, this is a crop that will redeem the basoga. Mm. Okay, mm. even the past what experiences, mm. but when they look at me who is pioneering, mm. they get discouraged. Now, what do we do? Mm. I see. That, that, that's another, another mm -hmm. challenge. Mm -hmm. I was challenged by the seedlings themselves. Mm. You open up the bag, you find others have brown roots, mm. others have white roots, mm. so we, we don't know which one is which. Mm. I can, Im I don't imagine whether it is the white roots that are drying, or the brown roots, mm -hmm. okay? There are so many I said. Others, I could, could have skipped my mind. Mm -hmm. But there are, there are many. Mm -hmm. But we need mm -hmm. a lot of advice from the government itself, mm -hmm. and the nerds which is spending a lot of money on us. Mm -hmm. They should come out, not keep quiet, but come out and do something to follow up their money, mm -hmm. so that they get what they expect from us. Mm -hmm. The challenges are always in the business and I believe one of the things that uh, we are here to tackle is share the right information that will help uh, lighten these challenges and solve some of the problems. So tell me, where do you see your, yourself in the next five years? Yeah, with the background, when I'm, with the background of Hasavakad, if it does well, mm. if it does well, I think I will be somebody to talk about in the region of Busoga. Mm -hmm. Because with the advice I'm getting from here mm -hmm. and with your visit which you promised to do, mm -hmm. I know within five years I have, I have accomplished my program because I intend to have about 80 acres mm -hmm. within five what? Mm -hmm. Five years. Mm -hmm. But again with the 15 I'm getting what? Mm -hmm. Challenges. Mm -hmm. So when I address these challenges, mm -hmm. I'll have at least seven what? Mm. acres of Hassava Kedo. Mm. And from what you say, and mm. from what we hear, mm. and from what we expect on the mm. world market, shall be people to consult, mm. and shall be people who shall be very useful to the community of Obusoga, because we have pioneered, we have grown through, we have gone through the things and, and the things, okay? Mm. And uh, we shall be an example of the rest of Obusoga. Mm. Our dear farmer here expect that in the next five years he will be at 80 acres mm. and that is a big deal so as avocare we want to work with you on this okay. journey you. we want to offer you the necessary help that you want you have the passion the government has come in to support uh, support uh, the farmers and avocare is also coming to work on this path we will help you where you require we will help you the technical knowledge you want we will help you when it comes to the, the fertilizers and, and the crop protection uh, inputs that you need so that we are able to build on this industry. Mm. And I can assure you, um, Avocare is determined to be part of this rise in, uh, in the Busoga region when it comes to the avocado industry. Mm. Thank you very much, my friend. I'm very, I'll I'm very visit, grateful. I'm visiting your farm soon. I'm very grateful, sir. And I know that we will go places. Thank you, You so don't much. need to worry. Thank you so much. Let Avocare worry for you. Yes, and as you concentrate running around looking for the resources to do your project, Thank you, Avocare much. will worry and do the right things for and you. And provide the right seedlings. Thank you very much. Yeah, we will. We are, we are propagators of seedlings. We will provide you with the seedlings. We will provide you with the technical support and know-how that you require and work with you on a one by one until we reach where the journey is. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Karibu sana.